Desensitizing a horse to frightful stimuli is always a useful way to spend time with your horse. The rope is one of the most common tools in horsemanship, whatever the discipline. That actually struck me when I started to ride horses, to see how many of them were scared by their own lead ropes. It just doesn't make sense to me. Good girl. The goal of that drill is to desensitize your horse to a rope thrown over his back, around his hindquarters, or his front legs. The more your horse is desensitized, the safer it is. Just imagine one minute your horse being entangled in a fence, for instance. A desensitized horse will wait for your help instead of fighting the pressure and getting hurt in the process. Principles are the same as those I explained in my program in the video dedicated to desensitizing horses with a flag. Basically, you keep throwing the rope until your horse shows at least one sign of relaxation. Some of them will just keep moving around. Do not give up. Walk with your horse and never stop throwing that rope. Even if the rope doesn't land on his back, keep the rhythm. Your horse will eventually stop. And that's the exact moment when you release and reward. With this kind of horse, during the very first session, you may not wait for that relaxation sign. Later on, he will not move around anymore. Then you will keep throwing the rope until you can observe a relaxation sign. Remember that you should practice all exercises on both sides. Most horses are pretty good on their left side, but comes some unusual stimulus on their right side and they get all spooky and fidgety. Work on both sides to have a well-balanced horse. Take that opportunity to desensitize your horse everywhere. From neck to back to hind and front legs. You never know when this will help you in the arena or on a trail. Finally, the rope is very useful to educate your horse to stand still when you cinch up the saddle. Wrap it around his belly, seesaw it, then tighten it up until your horse stays still and shows a sign of relaxation. That will prevent your horse to be cinchy in the future, and is a good trick to fix those problem horses, by the way. When you desensitize your horse in order to prepare him to accept the cinch or the girth, take the time to seesaw it all around the belly, including the close part of the hindquarters, as some horses might be shy over there. Finally, hold the rope in your fist and tighten it up to simulate the girth. Be ready to follow your horse, as some colts can actually move quite a lot before they get used to this new feeling. Eventually, they will stop, get relaxed, and understand that this rope and the girth, by extension, are not a problem. <laughs>